testing, testing, testing. Hmm. Oh, yo. I feel like Tizo, I'm back on that bullshit. If he talk reckless and empty the full clip, I don't sip no lean and I don't pop no bars. Shorty, she on me, she think I'm a star. I'm chasing this money, I really can't stop. All these bitches won't suck on my cock. If she cannot pay me, I don't want the top. Frosty, he blowing, he cannot be stopped. Ooh. Yo, what is up Bucketeers and today we're here with a new video But before we get into that go ahead and pass me the ox so we can get into today's paid promoted song Let me get that Alright, what y'all think of that? Y'all can let me know down in the comments below. Uh, if you want to hear the full song, the link will be down in the description and in the comments below. Now, I know what you're all thinking. No, I don't. I'm not a mind reader, but y'all see my shirt? Tonight is the night, bruh. Tonight is the night. I am going to go see Infinity War with my girlfriend. We, I got tickets for IMAX tonight, and I immediately got tickets for the next night as well. So I'm about to be in there, and I'm not I'm not reading the comments because I know how y'all are. As soon as y'all just heard me say that, y'all probably already in the comments trying to spoil it for me. But by the time y'all see this, I'm going to already be out, so it don't even matter. So nice try. But today... Today we're here with a topic video. I wanted to talk about something, something, you know, you just just having a seat with me. It's just like me and you just discussing something, all right? And let me know, let me know if y'all want more of these type of videos where I just talk about stuff going on, like, you know, hip hop. If like, oh, hip hop, I don't even know if we should like really even be using that word anymore with the type of rap that we got now, but just music, all right? Let's just say music in general, since, you know, a lot of the stuff that I do on this channel revolve around music, artists, and stuff like that. So, uh, if y'all want to see more of these types of videos, let me know. But, um, the, the topic I want to talk about today was Double XL because it seems like Double XL is kind of taking a plunge, and it's mainly the way that they handle how they go about picking different artists. I don't think people even really look forward to Double XL anymore. I think the best, the last best Double XL was, uh, all right, in my opinion, I think the last best Double XL was probably like in 2012 because that one had Hobson, uh, MGK. But I think, I just think that was the last best one. Now there's, I'm looking at this and there's like, like who, like who is, I don't even know where some of these people are. Is that Future? Yeah, Future was in this one, I forgot. There's only like, there was only like two, there's like only two people here like two or three people here that aren't even relevant anymore. I think ever since like then, Double XL has progressively just gotten, I would say worse, man. I, it's just, I don't think people really cared to be on Double XL anymore. Like if you see Lil Skies, uh, I think Lil Skies was up on Double XL. He was supposed to be, or apparently the 10th spot. And but he has put all of the business on Double XL that's going on. I don't know if y'all know. Everything, da da da. I didn't show up, you're right. I did not show up to XXL, I didn't, no. And you know why I did not show up to XXL for one? I'm going to tell y'all straight up. Because the people who see the media, they be trying to make shit seem all bad. And this, that, and the third, and all this shit. Nah, bro. XXL reached out to me months ago, bro. And chose me to be a, a 2018 XXL freshman. How the fuck do you choose me to be a freshman before the fans even get the vote? That's just not fair, bro. Like, the world didn't get the vote to choose those guys to be a freshman. Regardless, even on the vote poll, when the votes came up, when the votes came, when you guys were allowed to vote, I still won. I still got on the list. But even before that, they chose me to be an XXL freshman. Come on now. The list is rigged. I'm not about to be on no fucking, you're not placing me in no category, bro. Apparently, you're voting when you vote for the 10th spot. That doesn't matter. It doesn't, it, it, no one cares. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't go into effect. Apparently, it's just to help their site, you know, get some, some traffic. So, and they just, they pick you before, which means, like, you already know. And Lil, Lil Skies is like, nah, man, I'm real. I'm real to my fans. I'm gonna let them know. But that means, like, for the 10th spot, like, wouldn't X already know, like, what didn't does that mean like X already knew and does that mean like the other people already knew or was that just for this year? Lil Skies put that all out there and apparently Double XL when Lil Skies didn't show up 
to the double XL shoot or whatever it was that they had to do. I don't know if it was the cover shoot. They went to Rich the Kid, who has been up there like plenty times trying to get up there, and they've been ducking him. So when Lil Skies wasn't able to make it, which means they put Lil Skies over Rich the Kid, but I guess that makes sense. But still, like, you mean to tell me Rich the Kid, all the mother nine spots, you couldn't find Rich the Kid in there? But apparently, since Skies didn't show up, they went to Rich the Kid, and Rich the, Rich the Kid was like, no, you can you can go hoe off. I don't know if that was like out of like you only picked me because Lil Skies didn't go or if it was because of the famous Dex situation. Nine times out of ten, it's because they was like, okay, well Lil Skies is not gonna be here. I guess, I guess we can get Rich the Kid. Which makes sense, because like I would be mad about that too. It seems like a lot of people don't really care about double XL. Like Lil Xan said something. Looks like your boy didn't make double XL probably. I'm so sad. <laughs> uh, but okay. He looked really weird. I don't know what was going on, but he was like, I didn't make double XL or something. But he was slurring his words. I don't know what he said, but he didn't care either. I think as time goes, people are just gonna stop caring about the double XL. It seems like it's really turned into a meme. Cause like whenever like someone's rapping or like, even if it's like not good, Niggas would be in the comments like, oh yeah, Devil XL 2019, like I see it happening. This seems to be a joke, but I think as time goes and these new artists, you know, start to come up, I think they're gonna stop caring about uh, being on Double XL, which eventually will lead to people stop to stop caring about Double XL. But I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon because if there's artists up there, like apparently Lil Pump is up there. If Lil Pump is up there, like people are gonna watch that to see like what Lil Pump does. And if, if Ski's up there, then we de he definitely gotta be up there. I seen that Lil Pump and Smoke Perp might be on the list, which wouldn't make sense because doesn't that, don't they count as a duo? Which means like, that was bullshit that Ski and X didn't get up there last year when Ski, cause Ski definitely should have been up there last year, but I don't know. Apparently that's all speculation. I don't, I don't know if there's like an actual list that's out or that leaked or something or somebody figured something out, but that's what I've been hearing. As far as XXL goes, I think a lot of artists are gonna stop caring and really not even pursue it. Uh, unless XXL comes to them, I don't think they're gonna like press anybody like to try to get an interview or anything like that because they see how it is. Like it's like there's artists that are really good artists that be going up there, and they don't get picked. And then they they even try it like multiple times because then Jordan Lucas do this like multiple times and he still was like getting ducked. But what if he's up there this year? If he's up there this year, that you know that would be lit and it would make sense. He's got like songs with Chris Brown and stuff like that. But the way the way Double XL is headed, and people was already getting on the white lady like behind it. I don't know, man. I don't know. I feel like it's, to me, I feel like Double XL is definitely overrated at this point. Like, people have just been shitting on everything. Like, <laughs> even the freestyles. It seems like when people are doing their freestyles, they're not even taking it as serious as, like, they just be playing around like the ugly guy and, and all of them. Like, they just didn't, it, they were just, it didn't seem serious. But I don't know. A lot of these, they see freshmen, they're like, I'm not even a freshman no more. Like, I'm doing all this big stuff. So they don't even really need it. But I don't know. It was entertaining. I think the last really, really entertaining one was with like Uzi 21. I mean, yeah, Uzi 21, Lil Yachty. Like, I think that was the best. I think that was like the best, like, class in terms of litness. Cause like Lil Dicky was up there too. And I don't know. It was just lit. So, y'all let me know what y'all think though down in the comments below. I'm very interested to see what y'all think of Double XL. If you think Double XL is really that plateau where artists are still gonna be going for like next year with all, like all the new artists that's coming up, do you think they seek Double XL or want to be on the Double XL cover? I think, I think probably every artist wants to be on the Double XL cover, but I'm saying I don't think they're really pressed anymore. Like, I don't think they're gonna be that pressed anymore. I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments below. If y'all did enjoy this, this discussion, this topic, go ahead and hit that thumbs up for me. I'll go ahead and bring y'all more of that. That being said, bro, I'll catch y'all in the next one, bro. It's bing bag, bing, bing bag, chair, comfortable as bitch, you know. No, I don't want it to be over. <laughs> Please don't let it be over.